Acura NSX. So I own an online apparel company called Notorious Bastards. If you want to check it out, NotoriousBastards.com. We're also on Instagram at Notorious Bastards. And it is a t-shirt company, um, kind of based loosely off of traditional Americana tattoo culture. Yeah, so I was in a really good place to purchase a second car. My first car is a, a RAV4, so not exactly the, the sexiest ride out there. But I was considering all sorts of cars. I looked at a Porsche, I looked at the MK5 Supras, um, I looked at an older Supra, the MK3s, which is my first ever car. And uh, after looking through the market, I just decided that I wanted this NSX. It's the, a classic JDM supercar. It's amazing. I didn't know what to expect because I had actually never driven one. I didn't even drive this before I bought it. I bought it and uh, had it shipped to me from Georgia. So the first time I drove it, it was already in my ownership and I just had to deal with it whether I liked it or not, which luckily I love it. Um, it, it feels amazing, there's nothing like it. My favorite part about the car is that it has that true classic JDM look. I like that the front of the vehicle has more of like the square body type where the moment you look at it, it's instantly recognizable as being a, a, a 90s car. Um, and then the back of it, of course, is classic NSX. Um, I do have an aftermarket spoiler on that to just give it a little bit of a little bit of kick. But um, yeah, I'm really obsessed with the body lines, and I'm actually considering getting these side skirts for it that add an additional little scoop. Um, it would kind of match the curvature of the original scoop that's already there, just on the bottom. My first time coming to Portland Cars and Coffee was actually last weekend, last Saturday on Mini Cooper Day, so that was really fun. Um, I mostly found out about it through just the local car community. I'm in a car chat, like a group chat on Instagram. And then I saw the Portland Cars and Coffee's Instagram page, which you should follow. And uh, I, I, I ended up here. Last weekend was amazing. It wasn't as hot. Um, and then I saw that this weekend was Ladies Day, so I had to make an appearance. So Lisa, huge shout out to you for coming up with Ladies Day. Thank you so much for making this come true for all of us ladies here. I guess it's just me right now, but I'm going to speak on behalf of the ladies, so thank you.